Good morning. It is a rainy day outside. It's 8.50. I woke up at 8.15. I FaceTime Kaylee for a little bit because she's in Alabama with all this crazy corona sh and she's flying home so I was shit chatting with her for a little bit and now I'm gonna work out and you guys are gonna see a weekend in my life but it's a disgusting pouring rainy day tomorrow's Britney's birthday so I'm happy that we're getting the rain out today I'll be back when I'm done with my workout showered and everything and then I'll catch you up in a bit I'll see you after my workout so I just took a body shower and I usually moisturize and all that after my shower but I can't because I'm going to get a spray tan and I already showered way too close to the freaking tan you're supposed to shower like the night before but i just didn't want to shower last night because i knew i was working out in the morning and i was like why am i even gonna bother so it's 10 37 our appointment is at 11 30 i'm gonna eat something and then we'll leave i don't know if i'm gonna bring you guys along maybe i'll just do like a quick before and after i don't know maybe i'll bring you i don't know just keep watching to see whatever i do like what, what, what did I you want to get a spray water? tan yeah okay i don't know if mommy will be too happy with me I'm eating. I was just about to tell the vlog. Thanks for the intro. I'm eating my delicious yogurt with granola and strawberries and raspberries. <sighs> You're asking for a lot now. Okay, so we're a little bit late to our appointment, which never happens. So I'm gonna be back tan. Okay. See ya. Okay, so obviously we just got spray tans. And now we're gonna just jam a little bit to the new Beebs album because it's the best thing that ever happened to my life. I'd rather take my chance with you instead. Keep taking that emotion. You got me low. We do the exact same thing. I literally cannot believe the fact that Kalani and Justin Bieber are touring together. And oh, Don Tolliver in the weekend. Like literally what is my life? If the coronavirus is still affecting everybody by the time these concerts come and they f it up for me, I'm gonna throw up, probably. There's nothing I can do, but I'm gonna be mad. Can you get out of my The speed limit is 35. We're going 50. No, get away. Go in front of me because I can't go. I can't do the up before you got Okay, hi guys. So I just got home and what I need to do now is edit the rest of my video for Sunday so that I don't have to worry about it tomorrow. Tomorrow's Britney's birthday. I don't know if I told you guys that, but I have a lot to catch you guys up on. So first of all, the coronavirus has gotten out of hand and I've been hearing that we're gonna be quarantined to our house we need to get food because blah 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 I don't know all this stuff I have no idea what's gonna happen but it's really crazy and spreading like there's no tomorrow so I just really hope everyone is staying safe and washing your hands and not touching your face please but wash your hands for a good 30 seconds with warm water not wash your hands for two seconds and be done you know anyway we have some fun exciting news kind of got on but i'll tell you britney's birthday is tomorrow march 14th today's the 13th so for her birthday i got her billy eilish tickets one for me one for her they were so expensive my mom is paying for britney's and my ticket was going to be her gift because the concert is sunday literally the day after her birthday so we have her thinking that she's not going to this concert she's like oh my god like because we're buying the weekend tickets we're gonna get justin bieber tickets she's like yeah and i can't go to billy eilish like she loves billy eilish so we got her billy eilish tickets for the day after her birthday it was like a match made in heaven we were gonna give them to her on her birthday she's gonna be so excited and surprised we were gonna go the next night but the coronavirus f***ed everything up and now the concert got postponed to I think May or June, I don't know. Since the concert isn't tomorrow anymore, I'm feeling a little guilty that I haven't gotten her anything for her birthday. Technically, I did, but I'm not gonna be able to give it to her until so long. And if I knew this was gonna happen, I would've got her something else on top of it. But everything happened so fast, it got postponed yesterday. So the freaking coronavirus is going everywhere and I don't wanna go to the mall. So tomorrow, we're going to Americana. If you're from Long Island, you probably know what Americana is. Some people call it the Miracle Mile, whatever. It's like a strip of designer stores and really nice stores. We're going there to get our favorite, favorite, favorite pizza ever. Actually, probably second favorite. Amore in Queens is our favorite. Second favorite is 
Cipollini and that is a restaurant that's at Americana. So we're gonna give her her gifts beforehand before we go to lunch, but I think I'm going to be like, okay, you can pick anything out. So I'm gonna just let her shop around and buy whatever she wants. We'll probably go to Hirschleifers. I'm thinking she's gonna want something off-white, but I don't know. I think she'll understand that I don't actually have anything for her because of the fact that the concert got postponed yesterday, but guys, she is literally going to flip out. I'm so upset that it was postponed. Thankful it wasn't canceled, happy it was postponed, but it just would have been such a good moment. Like she would have been so excited. She's still gonna be excited, but I know she's gonna be upset about it being postponed because I said to her like, oh my God, did you hear that the Billie Eilish concert got postponed? She was like, I would die. Like, she was pissed. So I don't know what's gonna happen, but obviously I'm gonna be vlogging the whole surprise and everything tomorrow. She'll be vlogging too. So make sure to check out her birthday vlog. But now, I have to go to the post office and then literally edit for the rest of the day because I have to finish this video So I don't have to worry about it this weekend. Okay guys, so we ended up going to love and honey to get Brittany a few more birthday gifts We went to the bank. We went to the post office. I got my pretty little thing package And then we went to soul bowl too. I got a smoothie, but now it's back to editing I'm gonna try to finish this video now Molly and Paul are coming over later and we're all gonna watch Real Bros of Simi Valley with Brittany And my mom's gonna make us a crumb cake because Brittany wants one for like her pre-birthday I don't know so I'm obviously not gonna vlog myself editing for probably another hour and a half Hopefully it will be that short and then I'm gonna cook dinner probably make some veggies Oh, no, I'm gonna make stir fry. That's what I'm in the mood for <gasps> I just finished editing my video. Best feeling in the world. When my hard drive just went full. Oh my god. I just f***ing jinxed myself by. Literally, everything just like cancels out when this happens. So I'm literally praying to Jesus Christ above that this will all be there. Please, God. God is real. God is real. Oh my God. That was horrifying. I don't know if you guys know this because I didn't when I first started doing YouTube and stuff. But a hard drive, it's basically like another computer. It just keeps everything on there like all information documents pictures videos anything you need it's a separate plug-in so that once you plug it in everything pops up on your computer that you have on there and when it gets unplugged things that you've done can be damaged very easily but god must really be looking out for me because all is well but anyway i'm now re-uploading everything the coronavirus is literally insane there's just more news about it coming out every hour literally i'm as i'm like sitting here with a bottle of lysol on my bed it's it's just really scary. The state that Italy is in right now is horrifying and I'm praying for them, but it's just so horrible and my prayers are going out to literally the whole world right now because all we can do is try our best to stay in, wash our hands, and try not to just touch other people, literally. Protect yourselves in any way possible. Freaking Lysol everything. We literally can't find toilet paper, guys. Toilet paper has vanished off of this planet. I'm not kidding. Whatever. That's my rant about coronavirus. It is now 625. I'm gonna make myself some dinner. I'll catch up with you guys later. I want to clean my room after two. I'll see you with my din din. Okay, so stir fry is cooking up. My quinoa is boiling and we're almost ready for dinner. Look at how stunning. Just adding some soy sauce to it and you are set. Look who's here. My back. He has no Hi, flaws Gray about Gray. him. Oh my god, you stunning little roly poly. All right, so I know I said I was becoming healthy and all. Have a piece of cake, exactly. When this is around, there's no saying what I'll do. My mom makes the best crumb cake of all time. And if you tried it, you know. This weekend, I'll be eating like a queen. Not good, but that's because it's Britney's birthday weekend. It's not like I'm gonna eat crap for breakfast, lunch, and dinner. I'll have like a good breakfast, a good lunch, and then a bad dinner. Sometimes you have to do what you have to do and enjoy yourself, you know what I mean? I'm not like putting myself on a diet, I'm just eating more clean. Oh my god! Oh, okay. <laughs> He's like, get off. Do you want to pick him up? Oh my god, look at this. Oh, oh so you have to be really gentle when you put him down. Shut up. Uh, so right sweet of you. Okay. Oh. <laughs> Look who's home from school. Woo! We all just chanted when she walked in the door. Molly. 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 <laughs> Fun fact, Penelope is 
obsessed with Molly and Molly's obsessed with Penelope. Two puppies! This is Molly's first time meeting Grayson. Current situation! Me and Molly are in here and Paul is out here with Brian learning how to play on his PC. And Brittany's getting her hair done at, at what time is it? 10.30 p.m. Very nice. So we're just gonna do a lot of catching up and laying around. Because you have a lot to do. Yeah, so see you tomorrow. I wake up to hearing Brittany screaming. When do we ever open gifts without everybody? You the one who opened the gifts without us. You have to face the consequences. You know all the clothes she got. So? I can't even believe that this is happening to me. Sorry. I like watching people open gifts. Corrupted. Gorgeous. Look, isn't that sick? I'm literally still wearing my retainer right now. I think I know what's coming. What? I'm not saying. What do you think is coming? The tour? Guys, I want to go to Billy Eilish literally since she came out with the with the tour dates. Look. I'm so excited. It was supposed to be for tomorrow. Look. Oh my god, stop. We have two tickets. For us? Mm-hmm. Because no one else would come because they're so expensive. Like, oh my god! Okay, so yeah, I know. So that was my gift to you, my ticket. But now that it's not tomorrow, yeah. I feel bad. So when we're at Americana, you can pick something up. No. Yeah. I'm so excited! I woke up with the fat temple thing. Ugh. All right, so it's 11 o'clock. I'm tired. Me and Molly are gonna do a little ab workout, and then we're gonna start probably getting ready after that and eat something, and then go to Chippy Chippy. Okay, so we got half of the squad. I'm about to do Britney's makeup. So see you after. Okay, the so. The band's back together! Woo! Yes, okay, so I just got beat, and let me show you the fit for the day. Okay, so the fit for today, these two pieces from Love and & Honey, and then these adorable shoes from Steve Madden. We're going out to lunch in a few minutes. Look at how cute this is. I'm with the gang, 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 boys having out the coop. We really have the gang back together. gave like half of them out already but like I have like no joke an entire bag of wipes in my pocket because we need to wash our hands before eating any pizza you know oh say hi everybody hi. I'm vlogging on my phone right now because I didn't feel like bringing my big camera in guys look at this we're seeing look at the inside so we're going into Louie and Gucci. We just went into her Schleifers. Brittany couldn't really find anything she wanted. So we're gonna go into Gucci and Louie and I'm pretty sure she's gonna find something in Louie. Guys, I want these sunglasses so bad, like with everything in me. They're so cute. They're so extra. Very me though. We just went into Muala and I just sculpted this to literal mm -hmm. perfection. So we're having some dessert now for the birthday girl. And Molly could eat yogurt, so we're all good here. Marcus and Paul decided they didn't want anything. Brittany couldn't find anything at Louie or anything like that, so I think I'm just gonna buy her a bunch of earrings at our piercing place right now. We're going in. Oh, actually, I just had a baby. Okay. And there's no you writing on my cake because Brooke didn't want the people that work there to touch it. So we just have a plain cake with just absolutely nothing Brittany. On it. Yep. My life is so hard. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. some cake? Yes. Do you have anything to say? It's my birthday, guys. That's what I have to say. It's my little girl's birthday. The youngest. The prettiest. Mm -hmm. oh, Why do you keep saying that's that? Right. Did you sing happy birthday with us? No. We are gonna make some TikToks. Tune into Britney's vlog for us actually doing the TikToks. Okay. <laughs> So, I don't even know when the last time I spoke to you guys, but I'm literally so effing tired. It's 11 o'clock. Effing. We're gonna take showers. We're just gonna like unwind because I'm so tired. I've been going to sleep so early, so this whole time change for me is just... We're just party animals. I can't. We're just so crazy. <laughs> Tomorrow the plan was supposed to be. By the way, we're having another sleepover, obviously. Get used to this because she's home for the...
summer baby summer in march yeah so we're gonna have six months with molly so we get three extra months which is just a blessing it's just stunning but anyway tomorrow the plan was supposed to be to go to vincent's clam bar with my whole family we have reservations and everything as of right now we think we're looking at each other in the mirror we think we persuaded britney to stay home because you because know, we're all scared of this um rona thing called covid19 <laughs> we really 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 would love to emphasize the really want to go to Vincent's clam bar because we love it there and they literally just have the best food in the world And a lot of my family hasn't been there before so we really want to go But the coronavirus is getting very serious and it's supposed to only get worse And I just feel like we're pushing our luck if we, we go because we went out today and like lots of people if it wasn't scary. an occasion, I would uh, we would not, not have gone out. Like, what would be the point of going out to lunch? I'm fine with cooking home, but obviously we wanted to have a fun day with Brittany. So tomorrow is supposed to be the day for, like, my family because Sunday's everyone's home. But I don't know. We'll see. But if we don't go out to eat, it's going to be so fun because we're all going to stay home. And we're going to watch Real Housewives of New Jersey. The last Jersey. episode. <laughs> the last reunion. Well, of the season, not ever. I um, even say ever. Right? I got Molly hooked on Real Housewives. We're going to basically make Vincent at home. We're going to make so we're gonna have my grandma teach us how to make meatballs. We're literally gonna go to the if store. If we can find anything left in the supermarket. Anyway, the night needs to end here because I'm. This is what I look like. So yeah, I know I'm cracked and tired. Okay, so I gotta take off my makeup. The Time night. To get loony. I know we're gonna get probably psychotic after this because Ooh, we're like my favorite time really of the day. tired. <laughs> the witching hours. So I think I'm gonna end off the vlog here. I don't know if you guys are strong enough to see the psychotic hours. <laughs> you might have to get to know us a little bit more before you see that side. Side. of just complete delusion. All right, I love you. See you tomorrow. Good morning, everybody. I'm using my jade roller because I am so swollen from all the crap that I ate yesterday. And guys, I'm not a hypocrite. I'm just having a good weekend, that's all. I'm just actually having a good weekend, <laughs> so if you could back off, that'd be really nice. So we're gonna go with my dad and Brittany to Starbucks, and then we're gonna go to the grocery store because I don't know if I said this already, but we're not going to Vincent's. Look at my shirt right now. We're gonna try to get whatever food we can right now from the grocery store i don't know what's going to be there because they're literally out of everything there's lines to get into grocery stores like it's so crazy but we're gonna try to make vincent's at home and i'm excited to get starbucks because i haven't had it in so long because there's just no need for unnecessary sugar you know but today whatever gonna like get myself together and then see ya we got our starbucks tomato mozzarella panini grocery shopping here we go but i don't think you guys are gonna come because i don't want to bring Okay, so my dad took a few bags, but here's our outcome. We um, got a lot of good I don't stuff. Want that. Okay, so yeah, Brittany stuff. is on sauce duty, and Molly's just like helping out here and there, all around. And I am about to do chicken cutlets. I'm gonna make the chicken cutlets while this vegan baby watches. And Paul is on cleanup duty. Okay, so we've been cooking all freaking afternoon. Look at my sauce. She sauce. wants four jeans. And then I'm making the chicken cutlets for the chicken parm. And Paul is cutting up the cheese and Molly's making the bruschetta. Queens. And we are the definition of Vincent's at home. That looks so fat. Good yeah, I to do a, Look at how many chicken cutlets we have. We're using fresh mozzarella because they didn't have shredded at the store. I'll come back when we're putting all of this in the oven together. I'm getting the chicken parm all ready. There's a bunch of chicken under there. And we're putting fresh mozzarella on top and then baking it in the oven. We just made some delicious bruschetta and I literally can't look at it for any longer because I want to eat it right now. Oh, Vincent's fine. at home, everybody. So so, so excited to eat this. What my plate is looking like. Oh my god. Hi guys. It's been a minute. That is it for this weekend vlog. I hope you guys enjoyed. This is my first ever weekend vlog. This will be up the following Wednesday, so I'm gonna be editing this Monday and Tuesday. I'm posting it on Wednesday. I just wanna say I love you guys so much. Like, all of your comments on my videos could not be sweeter, and it means the world to me. Like, you guys are just so sweet in the comments, and I literally just love talking to you guys in the comments. It's so much fun. Every time I go on my phone, I go right onto YouTube because I always like to see the next comment that I can answer or whatever, but yeah, you guys are just the best, and I'm so thankful that I have 30 
35,000 supporters now. We hit 35K and I'm already ready to get to 40K. Like I really, really, really want 40K. Listen, I don't know if I'm shooting for the stars, but I want 100,000 subscribers this year. I really, really do. And I think I am going to make it happen. I would also like to talk about this whole coronavirus. Please, everybody, wash your hands. 30 seconds, warm water, get under your nails, scrub in between your fingers, like get in there, okay? Make it a habit not only to prevent from getting the coronavirus, but just germs in general. Like you never know what you can pick up in these dirty public areas, you know what I mean? So just make it a habit for the rest of your life, but especially now. And even if you wash your hands, don't touch your face even after that. Like this is the craziest spreading virus and I can't believe what is happening in the world right now. But please just try to restrict yourself from going into big crowds. I'm really gonna try to stay in. If I don't need to go out, why go out? I just feel like people don't really know how serious this is. It's just crazy and I hope everybody stays safe and clean and healthy. So on that note, if you watched up until the end of this video, comment wash your hands with a soap emoji next to it to remind everybody to wash their hands. Thank you for watching me on YouTube. Thank you for watching me talk about random stuff. And thank you for caring about my life because it brings me so much joy that I get to do this and that people actually care that I'm doing it. You guys know I love you a lot and I really truly do mean that. You all mean something to me. Remember that. That's really it for this video. Have a beautiful week ahead of you. Uh, well, when I'm posting this, it's gonna be the middle of the week, but have a beautiful day, week, year, month, whatever. Just stay healthy, take your vitamins, and eat your vegetables. Peace out.